Hey everybody, welcome to the Crap <sighs> Bad Comedy Podcast. My name is um, Max Sorich. I'm a real comedian, uh, and I'm here with uh, Jason. More like Max. I'm Max so poor. <laughs> nice. <laughs> and then uh, we got a Max no rich. I have no money. Nice. Hell yeah. But you got Sorry, a machete. Have hey, a machete. do you know what airlines uh, uh, Chris Damon takes when he goes uh, flying all over the world? His favorite airline, I guess, or his favorite airport to fly out of, I guess, is No, no Hair, no hair yeah. Airport. <laughs> Wouldn't recommend. Yeah, that's where I'm flying with Blake. <laughs> Do you like that one, Dylan? I'm a train guy. It's more of a train guy? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Is, is your favorite train the bald line? It's a <laughs> union station. Yeah, you're Do you actually, like taking the blue a guy line? What makes you say that? Because you're gay. Yeah, well, because you had sex with the blue man group guy, remember? <laughs> Man. Do I take him to have a sex with the blue man line? <laughs> hey, I was ripping off of him. Guys. All right. <laughs> he started that line of thinking, and you're now you're blaming me. Just, hey, man. <laughs> the first thing you thought of. I was talking to Nero. That was the first thing he thought of. Yeah. The, well, I was talking so about he's Chris gay. Damon. Yeah, so he's the gay one. And you said you like But trans. you're also gay because of what he accused you of. Mm-hmm. First of all, and I because I chose gay. to be. I Secondly, I ain't gay. <laughs> I think it's cool that we I think team be- up on each other sometimes, but when we have a guest on, we really need to come together against the guest. <laughs> 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 we do we do sometimes. We come yeah. together against Ham Talent. Yeah. But it, I mean they don't we can't let them divide and conquer us, you know? Yeah. Mm-hmm. The guest well, the guest is the enemy. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Always. <laughs> That's the point of this podcast, folks. We love our listeners, hate our guests. <laughs> 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 Uh, so what's uh, yeah, what's, what's cracking? Who's cracked? <laughs> <laughs> we got some uh, new stuff up. We got the Ramones on the wall of ops. I love it. That's mm-hmm. uh, Jim Morrison and Stephanie Robertson and Eric Freddie. I seen uh, her at Power Hour last night. Oh yeah, you well, saw you saw, I saw her. Well, I, I seen her and well, then, she had a pretty good set. I went up to her. I was like, "Great set!" And then she goes, "I'm Jim Morrison." <laughs> <laughs> you saw Jim Morrison. Just kidding. I would never talk to Stephanie Robertson. Mm-hmm. <laughs> It's not nice. Yeah, well, I don't like her. Well, this is public, so cool. Uh, well, I don't care. <laughs> I think she's cool. I think she sucks. Oh, it looks like I'm coming out as a good guy. She's very funny, but she's mean, and I don't tolerate that. <laughs> Do you like uh, the, the Ramones? <laughs> Do you like the Ramones? I think Eric Freddie's not. I prefer the Doors. I think Eric Freddie's not funny, but he's, <laughs> he's not funny, but he's nice. That's what I think. Yeah, he's yeah. very nice, so I like but him. Very, but very not funny. <laughs> yeah. So like Jim Morrison, comedy. hilarious. Jim Morrison is one of the best comics on the scene. <laughs> Huge laughs. Yeah. Do you remember when we used to fantasy book the best show ever that we could think of? What? We used to fantasy book like the best show that we could ever put together, like a local showcase. Let's do it. Should we do this on Let's the free draft. episode? We'll do a draft. <laughs> yeah. We should do a draft of like we all get a show. We each... Who's your? <laughs> well, I'm just realizing we should put this kind of stuff behind the Patreon. Well, we'll, do that. Uh, we'll do that in the last half hour, folks. So maybe we should make them worse. Yeah, guys, yeah make, make them wait, guys. We're doing an hour and a half, just so you know. Right now, if you're listening, um, the hour is going to go on all the platforms. The last half hour is going behind the paywall. That's where we're going to unleash. Mm-hmm. And there's a lot of money behind that. Paywall. And we're ready to to unleash. <laughs> <laughs> Punish people, right? Well, so, what should we do when we eliminate somebody from the wall of ops? Like MC Lights. Once we kill them, DJ Dark. Yeah, but he he quit comedy. Yeah, so. maybe we should have like a living and dead section uh-huh. or something. I don't know. Yeah, like or like, like um, we won. Or like two halves. You could have like one side. It's like current targets, and the other side like crossed <laughs> off. Yeah, or something like that. <laughs> we cross these motherfuckers off in blood. I like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hell yeah, bro. Sometimes when I'm on drugs, uh, I get a paper cut. Mm. And I'm uh, not worried about the blood loss. It's just the loss of uh, drugs, mm-hmm. no bloodstream. No, I ha- I no hate blood loss and no blood found, they say. Mm-hmm. I hate the paper cut because it ruins the trust I had with paper. Mm-hmm. I like the song. Yeah. I like the <laughs> song. Makes tough. me nervous. I like the song Paper Cut by Linkin Park. I don't know that one. How's it go? I don't remember. Hit, hit me with a few bars. I think I that's how he died. I think I remember how it goes. I think he did. He, <laughs> yeah, he, 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 Dan Dosey most steals jokes. No, he, he <laughs> was. Isn't that how he, it goes? <laughs> he, he, he Wait, that. do you know that song? Uh, Hunter steals and pews. <laughs> I stole in yeah. so many jokes. Wow. No, but I like that. Why is Hunter st- like he's shoplifting from the uh, thrift store? <laughs> he's like, oh no. Wow. <laughs> 
Wow. I'm Dude, fucking up everywhere. Shane Bianchi over here. You really cannot control your house. First, <laughs> it got rid of all your hair. You now it's knocking over water. Folks, he knocked Against over Against your glass. will, your head went and threw out all your hair. Shane now Bianchi it's style. knocking over <laughs> oh, whole no, glass of water. I have an extra shirt here. Shane Bianca. Did you just try and uh, put that... Uh, Isn't Bianca the name of one of the mice from The Rescuers Done Under? <laughs> I've never seen that. <laughs> Bianca. That sounds also like a Street Fighter character, but I think I'm thinking of, what's it? Bara- uh, Barack Obama. Barack Obama. Um, That's old Junior Stopka joke. Worst Mortal Kombat character ever. <laughs> <laughs> I think that... Uh, Barack Obama. Most Biancas are black that I know. I know if you, I know Bianca Brownlee, Bianca James. I know uh, Bianca White Chick. Oh, she's white? No, black. That's weird. Isn't it crazy that KJ Whitehead is black? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it, um, do, do you need help with the know. with the spill? I can get I you a towel. I think it's kind of one of those I situa- you, it's all I feel bad that you're cleaning it up here. with your extra shirts. I kind you're of supposed to donate to. Up. I felt bad. Aren't you supposed myself. to donate those shirts to homeless Adam Crochetti? <laughs> hey, remember? Remember last he time we had to get a towel for Dylan? Remember last time we had to get a towel? Well, what was oh, happening? Or I went in there to grab a towel for Dylan. Yeah, we had to put a, a <laughs> piece of wood behind your tongue or something. <laughs> you guys, who Secrets got me into that folks. situation? <laughs> well, you you, you could talk about it. You probably should have had dinner. You know? um, I believe it was a mix of peer pressure and poor uh, child parenting Yeah, I, when was, you were a child. <laughs> I don't really believe in free will, so I think I'm innocent. <laughs> It's not my fault. Yeah. That's a good. That's a good uh, defense, dude. Uh-huh. It's so weird. It's, <laughs> it's so weird that life. he never eats food, and then like when he like faints or is like really like sick or uh-huh. something, yeah. it's he's like that's not my fault. It's, it's not. He doesn't have free will. Yeah, he doesn't. Yeah. He, I mean, just, I he doesn't it. eat food or drink water, and then like like the sustenance you need to live. Yes. I'm just and then when you don't feel well, a, it's not your fault. <laughs> I'm trapped in like a experience I have no control <laughs> over. An experiment. <laughs> experience. <laughs> Jimi Hendrix, ever heard of him? Have you ever heard of uh, uh, maybe you should give him a listen? Jimi Hendrix? Yeah, I know Timmy Hendrix, mm-hmm. Timmy Tootle. I'll tell you what, Foxy <laughs> Lady, folks. I'm drinking Foxy Lady. I'm drinking piss on on the rocks today. Um, Shout out to piss. It's also one of our sponsors. Mm-hmm. Yep. <laughs> it's also Cool Steeper Club. <laughs> Shout out to uh, make up a bunch of Cool them. Steeper Club. How I much? have them on Twitch. What's the deal? I have Osama bin Ladle's soup shop. <laughs> <laughs> we came up with that when yeah, you came yeah. on Twitch. What's the, I made a whole ad and I used a chat GBT to generate all the copy <laughs> and shit. What's the <laughs> what's the deal we have with Cool Steeper Club? I also am what's the percentage off? What's the twenty five percent off Tw- Cool Steeper Club dot uh-huh. com. When you use the promo code Bad Comedy. Yep. So that's what I'm drinking here. Um, is Cool Super Club. It's not piss actually this time. It's also uh, Ritual Zero not Proof. Yet. Hey, when you drink piss, <laughs> you live in bliss. And that's it's what, also it's also says. actual whiskey too. So mm-hmm. yeah. it, it's four different things. It's a mix. It's a cocktail. Whatever you want this to be, it can be. This could be a piss on the rocks. Mm-hmm. Piss on the rocks. Whoa, that, that's not, that sounds like a good drink. Piss on the rocks. Piss on the rocks. I'll take a piss on the rocks. Uh, what about a piss? Uh, what, about what he's having? What about <laughs> yeah. a yellow snow cone? That'd be that'd be a good name of a drink. Did you hear about the two gay guys sixty nine? One of them said, "I'll have what he's having." That's pretty good. <laughs> nice. I came up with a t shirt idea. You know, you could have just said, "Would two, you guys want to guys sell sixty nine <laughs> to imply that they're gay?" I think it's two guys sixty nine. They're you, not you, necessarily gay. <laughs> <laughs> They're just uh, getting off. Two gay guys that are gay. <laughs> Haven't you ever heard of Bobby Lee? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Didn't he do a bunch of weird... He like 69 upside down or something. Like <laughs> no, that was him. No, that was him talent. Yeah, that was a rumor I heard about him. <laughs> 69. Uh, last week, I had some good riffs uh, just yelling to the camera about how... Uh, about how my, how my life's a joke and it's laugh 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 not live laugh love oh i love that <laughs> <laughs> or live laugh laugh oh i wanted to pitch this t-shirt idea and to you we, guys we, we, hold on we came up with the idea like uh that i've been doing improv for 30 years like mm-hmm. you will need to take classes for this shit i have 30 <laughs> years experience yeah, doing, doing improv comedy, 30 <laughs> that, rules. Years. that rules plus once you get canceled in the i in the improv community you kind of have to do it on your own yeah yeah <laughs> They won't let you sign up. Well, I didn't want to do the. I didn't need to do the classes. Charna found out I killed a dog, so she won't let me sign up. Wow. By the time I started doing comedy on, <laughs> that's a, a pretty deep reference. Do you even go? 
No. Oh, Chart is the like leader of IO and she always on Facebook posts like all this pet shit. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. That's, that sounds like uncharted, ter- uncharted she, territory. She's like heavy into like PETA funny. and then not putting uh, minorities on improv teams. Mm. Okay, she, that's she, funny. She's, she picks her causes. <laughs> yeah. So My she's like, uh, she, save the black she's kids. Like, I love, I love, don't help the black kids. Uh-huh. Or I like, I like uh, PETA, but I hate Jake PETA. Hates uh, people yeah. with disabilities. Hey, I still haven't gotten booked yet. Uh, people from <laughs> that are these ableist people. Didn't you see the thing where I have Crohn's uh-huh. disease? You're a Crohn's warrior. Yeah, that's an, as a, as an ADA disability. I'm a Crohn's uh-huh. warrior, and I'm going to start calling shows out one by one. Is uh-huh. this your ring? It's a ring. Name yeah. some shows that haven't booked It has you. that, too. Whoa, it's got a little uh, Coke box. In Name the some of the shows that yeah. blacklisted you. Um, I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm I don't a, know I'm which a, ones I'm, yet. I'm not important enough probably to be on the <laughs> book list. <laughs> I got in trouble when I was doing pimprov. Uh-huh. Said the N-word. Oh, <laughs> I did blackface. I was that. being a black pimp, though, or whatever. Yeah. I'm on the do I not book the list because I can't read. Yeah. I'm on the do not the, do not brook list because I'm a stream. He's on, the, he's on the do not cook list because he's not allowed to eat anymore because he's mm-hmm. too fat. That too. <laughs> Like All right, here's my t-shirt girl. idea. <laughs> All right, it's got a picture of a three, four-leaf clover on it, and it says, kiss me, I'm black. Nice. I like what that. do you think? Can we sell that in the store? Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Or get a, get a shamrock. Because I want to buy it. <laughs> get, <laughs> yeah. Wear it. You know, get a shamrock and then get Aryan Brotherhood written yeah, on it. Yeah, it says... Because uh, if you go to jail and you have a shamrock tattoo... Kiss me, I got a big fat it, it, cock. It's, it's, a, it's basically false flagging. Like, if you're just a normal Irish guy and you have mm. a shamrock tattoo, that's the Aryan Brotherhood's... Sign in jail. Yeah. So if you have, then you're not Aryan Brotherhood. That was I heard it's something ass. like false flagging, but it's like when you go to jail and pretend you're gay, it's false. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> ing. Yeah, and they're like, come on, man. I want to have wait, gay fall, sex no. in jail. Wait, it's kind of like, it's like false. Water. Ing. Oh, you just spilled I it. To, I went to drink my water. There's no water. You can have a, <laughs> you can have a, you can have a sip of my cool steeper club or my coffee if you want. Those sound better than what Max drank in my right? <laughs> cool, steeper coffee. Yeah. Oh, it's cool. Coming up. Cool. Yep. Uh, ch- uh, go to the Take website. It's not on there, but yeah. you can get to you. I think if you email them, they could. They, they'll probably invent it. Invent it. Yeah. <laughs> Tom's a good inventor. Yeah. What's your favorite invention? We have, a, we, we have, we have a new patron, uh, but I'm going to keep him anonymous. Whoa. DuckTales. Congrats. <laughs> uh, wait, hold on. Birds. Oh, I got to do the thing. Uh, uh, the pig bird himself. Welcome Sam to the party, pal. Who's our Sam Talon signed up? Look at that t-shirt. No. Sam Talon's so big, we had to charge him for two memberships. Hey, Jason, <laughs> that t-shirt, there's too many fingers. What? What is yeah. that, AI art? And there's not enough fingers on that one. Why is it so fucked I don't know. Up? I, I thought this is a... I could tell that's This fake. shirt, from what I had thought when I put it on, it was a... Uh, a deformed yeah. hand uh, charity. No, uh, Hunter yeah. Hearst joined our normal tier. Okay. Yeah. Is that who the patron is that you're going to bring up later? Mm-hmm. No, oh. I was going to bring up now. <laughs> okay. Okay. Look, okay. At the end of the episodes, I do all the names anyway of our beautiful. I patrons. prefer Gatherer Hirsch because yeah. <laughs> they're like uh, yeah. they're they're you too like good. that joke? I'll sell it because they're like too poor. <laughs> I like I like Gatherer Biden. I'm kind of like Gatherer Biden. Oh, nice. That's yeah, pretty funny. I'm like, I, I love drugs, but I don't have the resources. <laughs> what if we do impression of, I say it's Joe Biden, but then I do Barack Obama. That'd be funny. Do it. Uh, I'm uh, not Joe Biden. So <laughs> I full, ain't Joe Biden. Disclosure, they're doing <laughs> oh, all hell my jokes no. right Shit. now. Uh, <laughs> I ain't Joe Biden. These are all my jokes. What, mine I just did? Well, they're not that, all my jokes. Uh, yeah, no, actually, you can jokes. have... I can't do your jokes. It's too many slurs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. I do actually want to sacrifice my comedy career on uh, bringing blackface back. Because <laughs> mm-hmm. I back. think you know the Keegan the Bi- Keegan the Bike comics for. leaving, so you can be Dylan the racist comic. Because <laughs> we need a a white guy with uh, a name the something. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Plus, Cause you get to wear a helmet. Dylan the brown mumbles the brown. Because <laughs> there, there, mumbles the brown. Because yeah. there's a lot of cool black. That'd be cool if you took that on. There's yeah. a lot of cool black guys like Kyrie. Oh. Kyrie the comic. I need to interrupt like everything this. right now. I have the most important news ever. <laughs> OJ, I did a OJ show. De Lamont. I did a show in Davenport, Iowa, and the comedian who was hosting the show. Goes by Chicken Bone. <laughs> oh yeah, legitimately. I chicken Bone. A, I just put a clip online. I go, thanks, Chicken Bone. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, it's so it's amazing. He, he's like this old white guy too. I was like, dude, wasn't there a guy? I go, it's amazing. There's a guy named Chicken Bone here, and he's white. Mm-hmm. <laughs> chicken Bone like, what, thing. It's who sad, gives man. themselves that nickname? On that weird West Side show, there's a guy. There's Chicken Wing, maybe. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, Chicken Bone is our infamous no, I know. podcast. Yeah, that needs good. to be on the wall of ops. Mm-hmm. The, the chicken bone? Yeah. yeah. Sorry, Rory Songer. I'm going to uh, have your thing printed off and we'll uh, get it framed. Yeah. Well, sorry, we haven't done that yet. We've been busy making Ramones. We were helping out this other guy we know named Rory Pomer. Some of the people yeah. listening. <laughs> he does poems. No, it's, it's uh, uh, Buari Bonger. Yeah. Rory. We were helping out Rory uh, yeah, we, we, sorry, we have, we have another patron, very similar name. And R- also, we were helping this guy, Rory Short Storier. <laughs> we should bring the <laughs> listeners up to speed in case they don't know. Oh, shout out Zeke Zoogler for, uh, for talking shit on our behalf uh, against Sam Talent. What did he do? Uh, on, the, on the comments. <laughs> oh, shit. I haven't been keeping up with this. This is on Instagram. I mean, if Sam has been talking shit to no, us. No, no, no. It was on a thing where we were talking shit about him. I feel like he's trying to let it die, you know? Who, Sam? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah no, but it, a, it's yeah, not. The last thing that will no, never, never happen. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, th- I, think, I think he commented on the ha- on the Ham Talons video from today. Oh, really? He thinks we will just stop. Shout, shout, shout out Zeke yeah. Zoogler. Yeah, we will never quit. <laughs> this guy's insane. Uh, yeah. Um, I wish I wish my name was Zeke Zoogler. Maybe he was. Maybe was uh, I would have to that. I love that alliteration. I would do so much. If that was my stage name, Zeke Zoogler. Mm-hmm. It's an awesome name. I would do so well. Yeah. Same jokes, different name. I think it reminds me. This is a wrestler name. I can go by Mac N word. I'm gonna be honest, Jason. Huh? I'm surprised you didn't notice my T-shirt. Why? Well, I have my sunglasses on, so I can't see it. Mr. Perfect. Oh, I love Mr. Perfect. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Do you like wrestling, like pro wrestling? No. <laughs> but I'm learning. I don't like Sam Talent. I'm wearing an ironic shirt, too. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Perfect. I You're wearing going. it more literally. Well, yeah, and I just noticed, like, there are so many chapters in finding out how much you love pro wrestling. I see it old twitter account well there's different types this of, is where i make fun of wrestlers there's different there's <laughs> different types of wrestling what, fans. what about twitter there's, don't you have an old twitter account i swear oh i do yeah, oh, yeah well, <laughs> I, I, I started I another twitter because i used to watch every wrestling pay-per-view and i wanted to tweet all my jokes but then i never jason by the way which twitter do you use but is, then the, I is saw, the cool jason melton one okay yeah but i don't use twitter that much just we're at, root beer Friday. I just started uh, writing down ideas on it recently. I like, yeah, I've been seeing the bad but, comedy stuff. I put a he, thing he's, on, he's, do you have Twitter? on Twitter. Do you have Twitter? Yeah. I marked, I marked bad comedy. Oh, I'll follow you too. So me and I him, mark you guys as like, uh, uh, what do you call it? So I see your important. notifications. His that way, is, I, his name nice. is Wow. Because I don't like I don't like looking at Twitter in general. I just like looking at my friends. Mm-hmm. So yeah. I'll mark you so I don't forget right You'll now. mark Norman him. So you, so uh, yeah. you, you almost went out to lunch with Mark Norman? Yeah, <laughs> and, but uh, but unfortunately, he was out to lunch. Oh, so nice. he probably with somebody cool. He didn't text he... us back because he's stupid. Why do you name his new special? <laughs> was it? Well, his one before that was out to lunch. But then this one's called. What it's, it's, it's called. called uh, it's called. I'm gay and uh, too scared yeah. to drink. Follow us on Twitter, folks. He oh, yeah. o- he o- he, uh, underscore comedy pod. Mm-hmm. He openly admits he's autistic on stage. Isn't that your bit? <laughs> that I've just been told that by every comic I know. Mm-hmm. You might not be autistic. You might just be from the Upper Peninsula, and uh-huh. it's like hard to tell. I think that that has something to do with it. To be honest, you, were you raised by the was... trees? Trees, yeah, village. That's why. That's why he takes. <laughs> Forrest it takes Gump. an orchard. <laughs> it, takes it takes a, a forest, forest gum. <laughs> it takes Dude. a forest to raise Dude. a reed. That is so funny. I'm picturing you just out in the trees all day. Yeah. Talking to just them. Just among them. It yeah. makes way more sense. For Talk, you. Talking to them all monotone. Yeah. He's hey, knocking what, on them. Who's there? Hey, what's up, Mr. Wood? Hey, what's up, uh, Grandma from Pocahontas? I remember in college one time, this professor was Pocahontas like, talked to a tree. Yeah, see the weeping willow or something? Yeah, yeah. Is there grandma or some shit? Weeping you know what Native American believes that kind of shit? Yeah, weeping willows are pretty cool. They believe in the craziest horse shit like that you shouldn't litter. Yeah, Native Americans I can't believe I that. Actually, like have some yeah, that we can't have their land, and they change their mind. Yeah, <laughs> that we don't own this. They're such shit. Indian givers. Yeah, for real. I'm like the Indians <laughs> from going from the Upper <laughs> Peninsula to like Chicago <laughs> area. Like first day on campus in college from the Dracula, like the one Upper of the Dracula. First kids I was talking <laughs> You're from to from the Upper Dracula. 
All right. Are you <laughs> <laughs> burn all the witches and burn an for upper drag? I get my stories interrupted all the time. <laughs> I just keep pushing through it. Yeah, yeah I just think Mac has totally turned off his ears so he could talk whenever he wants. Mm-hmm. It's wild. Yeah, I, I, I turned my headphones off. I've turned my headphones yeah. off for the past ten episodes. This is my impression of Mac as a rapper. Turn my headphones off. Mm-hmm. <laughs> turn the <laughs> snare off in my headphones. Can you turn off the? Yeah. Can you turn off the beat? In there my is headphones? there is snare. Can you please turn off the snare in my headphones? <laughs> <laughs> you still mad because we interrupted you? You so? <laughs> yep. So you came. You, you came down. Do you want the floor? You, you want came the ceiling? Da- you came down from the upper drag floor. Mm-hmm. What happened? It was just one of the first friends I thought I made on campus. Kind of a Sam Talent situation, if you ask me. This kid, I were we're hitting it off. You know, he plays football. He's balding already. And uh, wait, who are you talking about, Sam? No, this. And then he went on. So this okay. guy, this guy went on his own podcast and talked shit about you. I just missed a part. I asked a question about your story. I wasn't interrupting. But then what did Mac do? I, I oh, added. I, I added to it. Nope, you interrupted it, and now. The context is farther Look, back here. You ever play Guitar Hero? I don't like walking on eggshells we know, around we know you, where Dylan. It is. You had a simi- it was because a- the eggshells remind me of your head, and it makes me feel like I'm stepping <laughs> yeah. on your head. That's Humpty Dumpty. <laughs> when I'm walking on eggshells. That's Humpty Dumpty you're thinking about. <laughs> yes. Um, so Humpty Dumpty watch, reminds uh, me of your head. Amanda Show. The yeah. Amanda Show. And they the, have the, the retarded lobsters. girl in the bathroom, and she's like, I like eggs. <laughs> no, I don't yeah, remember I remember that. that. I do remember that. I'm just making fun of a retarded girl. But <laughs> she's like, I like, I like eggs. That. <laughs> that's what, that's <laughs> what Will Ferrell's whole career has just been impersonating Jeez. a retarded guy, and mm-hmm. everyone's cool with it, but in the future, people are going to be like, Dude, that was, that re- was not cool. Yeah, about, like, he's the, he's the L. Jolson of retards. Yeah. Uh-huh. I like Tom that. Hanks did retarded face. I was a big fan oh, yeah. of the Dancing Lobsters, but one time I went to go see the Manager Show live, and in person, it's actually the Dancing Hermit Crabs. Oh, no. <laughs> it was three not times what I many? asked. It's not what I paid to Dude, see. Dude, that sucks. Yeah. That would ruin my birthday. Yeah, normally it was like five Dancing Lobsters. It was three Dancing Hermit Crabs. What, though? That's less. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I Kermit crab man, um, hell of a dancer. Yeah, he's got I, legs. I Kermit. Yeah, I Kermit crab. He's a good dancer. That's what he said. Dancer, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah he, That's what good. I said. He's good at dancing to that. Joke. I'm gonna start talking <clears throat> louder now. <laughs> oh, I turn you up. Sorry. And I'm gonna start I mean, talking louder. You still have to. I still well, have to get so some kind of surgery. In my, I have to get a brain surgery that will make me listen to you. Also, uh-huh. <laughs> well, <laughs> you have like, it? I don't Tune know. If the, up a notch. I don't know if the volume's enough. Well, for some reason, you I talk, also need brain surgery. You to talk quieter listening. into the microphone than you do in real life. If you guys don't <laughs> listen to me. You do need help. I, I heard every. I heard every word you said. Your friend. It was sort of a Sam Talent type of situation. Your that'd friend in college. A, on that'd campus. be a good catchphrase. I need help. And then what happened? <laughs> what, what happened with your with your Sam Talent type friend? Well, you just uh, said something about uh, you sound high, bro. He said that, and then you're like, and oh, I, I thinking, guess we're not really friends. Yeah. Well, I think it was the voice from uh, the Upper Peninsula, eh? <laughs> the UP. Was he like? Uh, you were raised by a weeping were, willow. You were raised by a weeping willow. <laughs> and the trees, like, <laughs> they spoke like that, though. Tell the us trees. a little bit about your homeland. What's the Upper Peninsula yeah, like? Yeah, was, was it like ants, like walking trees? <laughs> I'll tell you what people say. They I think performed at a casino okay. in, in Upper Peninsula, Harris, Michigan. How'd that go? Never heard of it? It was crazy because yeah. there was all these fat people just eating gravy straight up and then doing like, you uh-huh. f- you probably it was right wild. In. Is that the Island Resort No, I was, I was sick watching it, dude. It was crazy. I know, but then you did the same thing. Is that the no, Island? Kind of hypocritical. Yeah, it was the Island Casino. But that's a peninsula, folks. <laughs> it's an it island. It's crazy. They don't know the difference. No. <laughs> it's like Native Americans and Indians. Maybe the Island was their mashed potatoes surrounded by gravy. Mm-hmm. Wait. It's what, an Island. Wait, what's a peninsula? Is that when you put a pen inside of... Uh, Pat Tom Sulo. If you, if you actually look at the word, if you look at the word peninsula, like, it actually starts with penis. penis yeah, not come pen. on, bro. Oh. Yeah, grow up. Oh, uh, penis. You missed something, dude. Maybe you're not gay. Penis Dracula. Yeah, it's a penis Dracula. <laughs> mm-hmm. They take away. Up. Well, Dracula is the. That's a new. Uh, is when you have a penis. <laughs> Wait, no. Minus brothers. You minus dress up as good. a female the vampire. Pe- pe- the, when you're a Dracula, you're a Dracula in drag, so you have a penis. Penis. Pe- penisula. Uh, no, mine is pretty good, dude. <laughs> you're you, you put, it's where you put a pen in, in, inside of Pat Tom Sula's ass. 
That's pretty good. Yeah. I joined the Pen 15 Club when I was a child. Biggest mistake of my yeah, life. Yeah, people made fun of me so much. They said I was living on Penis Island. Yeah, they said I, yeah, they said I was gay. They said I was it, was, gay. it was on my hand, yeah. yeah. You ever play the penis <laughs> game as a kid? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Where you the know, guy puts his penis in your mouth? And then you grow no. up and you... And then, <laughs> and then you grow up and it turns into the N-word game. Okay. Yeah. yeah. We could talk about yeah, those kind of games. Grow up. <laughs> grow up and say the N-word. The new penis game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Called I win, yeah. Island Casino. Mm-hmm. I was open up for this I black win. guy, who uh, like uh, he had like you could have said guy. You know, you don't need to specify. Well, you, I'm just trying to paint a picture here. <laughs> uh, it's called color theory. His name was Gene, and uh, he I bombed every show because it was like a year in. Uh-huh. I remember thinking it was like pretty good paying gigs and i remember thinking like damn if i have to do these gigs to make money at comedy i should just quit now <laughs> it was so horrible but that's why we're online now baby because i also did so the po- many- i did the potawatomi in uh milwaukee and then uh-huh. we went up and did the island in uh, harris michigan pretty- they got one road in that town and it's just got a casino on it mm-hmm. it's weird yeah, there's not much going on up there. People think there are igloos. They think there are ants. Sounds like a one horse town to me. <laughs> <laughs> My one town is town. like 40,000. Like like Did hor- you grow up on One Tree Hill? There's a One Tree Hill Marquette, Michigan. Did you grow up in a one horse town? Uh, no, we, we the, it died. You know, there's that, another Marquette. There's a different gold. Marquette, and there's a college there. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. In Wisconsin? Yeah. Dylan said he wishes there was a. He said Dylan. Dylan said he wishes a one horse town. That way he'd have someone to talk to. Uh-huh. <laughs> there's like trees. The okay, I'll give there's you only one. There's only one big weeping willow, and then yeah. his father tree. Oh, God, his, his father tree, which is the old end. Yeah. Could you turn that light on for me? Because I'll paint a picture for you. The, the upper peninsula. No, so that that it, ma- it, it makes a noise now when I do it. Uh, but the fans have to understand that is what the upper peninsula is like. But there are just like eight thousand more. W- White ones. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have any but black people the one up there? That, yeah, there's like five like percent, I think. Uh, like, pre- did you know any? That's pretty. Up. That's pretty urban. Because I grew up in Highland, <laughs> and uh, I was I mean, surrounded by black people in Hammond and Gary, but we didn't like have any in our school. Mm-hmm. What about I think this? I had more blacks than Jews. Mm. What about? I never. I, we had one guy who was half Jewish, and he celebrated Christmas and uh, Hanukkah, and it made me like pissed at him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we had a like, lot. Of, we had a, a lot of that's Jews. That's abusing the fucking system. Yeah, yeah. we had a lot of Jews and a lot of people that did that too. Yeah, fuck that. Yeah, you got to pick one. You either got to play the Dude. the bad top game, and or, he was <laughs> like, he was like super <laughs> annoying. You got to pay big. Beyblade or actually have to do the cool holiday? Yeah, Beyblade or no, go to have a pick dice. your choice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, he was like really annoying, and it was like clear his parents are spoiling. Yeah, <laughs> and then he celebrated Christmas. And remember when I had a tooth one. for fourteen hours? Yeah, that was cool. Yeah, I have two job interviews next what week. What did it? Zoom. Yeah, it fell I t- out. I told him to warn the person that I was missing oh, temporarily. No. I, it, can't, it, had, it was they, they temporarily glued it back on because uh-huh. they have to order a new one because it didn't chip off clean. It's Man. kind of a coincidence. I believe it was also the same way Michael Cooper lost his teeth was huffing epoxy. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wish I was a guy with a tooth inside of the tooth, so I know oh, when yeah. the tooth comes off, like a shark. The guy from the Pittsburgh, teeth grow yeah. back underneath. What is it? Yeah, it's the water, that the freaking there. Pittsburgh. Hey, hit me up, guy from Pittsburgh with a tooth and a tooth, because mm-hmm. I would like that second tooth. Shout out to all our Pittsburgh fans. I know we got a Pittsburgh connection and Chris. Like, oh yeah, shout out to uh, Dewitt. We haven't, was, we haven't given Dewitt a shout yeah, out. Yeah, I, I love that guy. I just hung out with him at the Scarpaces. Shout out. To, uh, the Just a couple man. of us pasties hanging out at the Scarpaces. Nice. Wait, what was Scarpaces? That was the place where uh, we could actually wrote the whole one of the Dan Tosimo songs. Oh. <laughs> we sat there with that, the corner, uh, in the corner. That uh, that other Jared, Jewish guy, Jared. Jared. I love that Jared guy. Halford. I saw him. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Mango, tell Jared Halford to join. Yeah. I'll give you commission. Is yeah, Mango. Mango no shout out to Andy Mango. I did a show with him in Erie, and uh, he was super funny. Nice. Who, uh, uh, did, did you guys go to that uh, the movie theater or no? I went there. Yeah, we went there for like five minutes to watch a roast battle, and the place was packed out. And really? it was like, Dude, and, Chris, and Chris was like, this is what it was supposed to be like for your podcast. I mean, the seats were all filled, so that was fine. I think yeah, but I mean, like this was like, battles. people were standing in the back. Like, it was just full. Yeah, people oh, love yeah. roast battles. That's but it was, it, it was also like, it's the comedians, so it's like all the comedians are there to watch, okay. plus some regular people. Mm-hmm. It's kind of like the same thing with the yeah. Chicago. I mean, for ours, uh-huh. it was a live podcast, and I knew about it, so. 
I was just telling someone but, about but, how the roast battles, like, they're like, Jeff Ross is coming, and it's like everyone just swarms, like, yeah. a thousand people to... Yeah, uh-huh. like the wart. I always wanted to see what it would be <laughs> like war, if, if somebody put a bunch him. of yogurt in a giant condom. <laughs> <laughs> the, you know the wart? That freak. The wart had sex with him. Jeff Ross. The wart had sex with Jeff Ross. Really? Yeah. We're talking about Matt Banward. He stuck his dick in the condom? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> in a kind of condom full of yogurt. He was like, roast me, roast me. Uh, yeah. I think uh, it's... <laughs> he, wrote, of, he wrote history. <laughs> oh, can I get this? I'm under your foot. I think it's, it That's kind of feels sad man. for comedy that it feels like the most popular shows are like the Tony Hinchcliffe show and roast battles because those shows are just sort of appeal to comedians. So it's like they're selling comedy to comedians. Like, yeah. uh, no, why not sell? That, why not make something good for everybody? Well, the, 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 the roast oh. ones are good for everybody. That's what I thought you were saying. I don't think they are. I think they're inside. They might make people and go the, see and the, stand-up. And the stand-up comedians no, the, like it the more than the crowd. No, the, that's why the, <laughs> the most hack people do well and win is because they do dumb hack jokes that people like. I'll say this as evident. Well, I'm saying roast battles not, not in comics. general. Not not necess- I mean, there might be roast roasts that you know are an exception to this. But I was in Pittsburgh and I'm watching this roast and I had no idea what the fuck they were talking about. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, it was all inside shit mm-hmm. and everyone and they were crushing. Yeah. That's what the with, with all fun. the comedians. Mm-hmm. People didn't people didn't like what I called Courtney Fat the whole time. Uh-huh. No, that was all people. Awesome I mean, that's jokes. just a. <laughs> That's just a role. I, oh, I, I was like, how? Do I, like, I was like, how did I not I win? How did I not win? Calling a girl fat for five jokes. <laughs> me, and Do- me and Donnie wrote a joke in the car that was like, uh, "How fat is a woman have to be before it's okay to catcall her?" <laughs> and I was like, I was like, you can't do it on stage because it's like, That's good. It's, you can't call women fat. It's like, it's like their n word. Mm. No, but <laughs> yeah, no, no but catcalling. So I thought yeah, Courtney I, couldn't win. That is a very good yeah. question. Like cat calling on the street, <laughs> yeah. like at a certain weight. If uh-huh. you're not calling the fat, like you're trying to, you're saying like that they're hot, like nice ass uh-huh. and <laughs> nice. Well, titty. the joke is like, like you know, if, if they like it, then it's a boost. Exactly. If they don't like it, they get their thing to complain about if for they the day because all D. they do is complain yeah, every day. You know. Uh-huh. So, so there you go. I'm gonna get. A, I'm gonna get a post that says laugh, <laughs> laugh, laugh. Yeah, I like that. Mm-hmm. You should do that. Maybe yeah. a shirt too. Yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> you came up with that? Was it you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I still think I came up with the corgi orgy thing. You didn't. I know Adam defended you, but I'm going to go back and look. He, I just, he, he said he's almost positive. Well, you guys are a couple of goofs. Mm-hmm. So funny. I'm going to find the truth. It's so positive. funny that you stole my joke. I would never steal your joke because I You're worse than Nando's could not mode. lower myself to that level to yeah. even say a thing that you said ever. I mean, you I have trouble every day. I pick new words just so I could avoid yours. You have <laughs> trouble getting. To, you understand. have trouble getting to level five sometimes these days. You're getting old. You're washed up. Mm-hmm. I'll get to level five and a half when I see a hot chick. <laughs> 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 nice. That's all, nice humble brag, dude. <laughs> you have a five and a half inch tail. Yeah, dude. <laughs> that's not the, hard, the hardest thing. Humble's the brown. Yeah. That is hardest. <laughs> I, I feed it to the ladies like a fish to a seal. <laughs> <laughs> Seafood. I told uh, there's a, I was at High Dive, uh, and I, uh, <laughs> this girl asked me what Kadeem Fuller's last name was. And I told her, I told, I, told, I, told, I told her, Kadeem Fuller, I told her his name was Devante because she was going to thank him. I don't get it. Wait. I just gave her a different black guy. Oh, okay. Yeah, dude, that would be hilarious. She just went up and No, but then I got, before she went up, I, you stopped. I saved it. Yeah. No, but, oh, I was going to, I got booked on high dive. Fuck. I, I was got gonna, mixed feelings about wow. it. I was going to say, <laughs> God damn it. Like, uh, sorry, guys, on this, I was going to open the podcast with, Hey, uh, my name's Kadeem Emptier. Ooh, I like that. <laughs> Shit. Maybe you can Kadeem yourself next episode. I'll Kadeem myself I'm next a, episode. You to, <laughs> <laughs> I'm a Kadeem about a quarter tank right now. What? Kadeem quarter tank. It's <laughs> <laughs> pretty good. <laughs> nice. Oh, uh, what about Kadeem glass half full? <laughs> Kadeem glass half is his middle name. <laughs> Fuller. His glass half full. <laughs> <laughs> glass half emptier. He t- yeah, he cha- like if he's happy, he's Kadeem. Actually, about, uh, actually, that guy's always happy when I see him. Like, he, he's a good dude. Fuller, oh, I just thought of a horrible racist joke. We gotta move on. <laughs> okay, he's got a good. How come all, wait, 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 wait. how come all these guys with lists? Dude, I, it was how come all these guys with uh, lists are funny except like like 
<laughs> Dale's funny. Kadeem's funny. James and Jar is really funny. <laughs> <laughs> the joke was like a uh, field of Kadeem's, but like you could see how that would turn into a <laughs> one of those. No, you, you know, you can make that into something else. <laughs> but could, but it's like, how do you not? Cor- no, but that's think a, of the horrible cor- quarter. Thing. Of yeah, the- but <laughs> as long as you add something to it afterwards. That was the alternate title for you could have made it a, a slave. You could you could field of Kadeem's. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, can you write down uh, 30 <laughs> more minutes? 34 minutes? I mean, if you want me to edit it. <laughs> just keep it. It'll be funny. I'm saying it's bad, okay? <laughs> I'm not saying it's good. I just thought of it. Yeah. Okay? The I dreams of Kadeem sound similar. I know it's bad. And you realize your mistake. <laughs> I tried not to say it, but then I Martin teased Luther it, so then I felt <laughs> guilty, so I had to... You could have made it like a baseball <laughs> joke. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Martin Luther had Kadeem? Yeah. So it's Kadeem. I had a Kadeem that one one day. What about Shoeless Joe McMahon? Shoeless Joe McMahon, I like it. Yeah. I'm Uh, okay. I had a Kadeem that one day I would be fuller. (laughs) Fuller house? (laughs) Oh, That's that's great. That's great. How about this? Uh, Shoeless. Because they legit called it something weird. Fuller house. (laughs) Dude, Shoeless. Shoeless. uh, I guess that's the other one. Oh, no. Because there's the house in the field. Yeah, and you came up with the other part to the joke. What about this? Shoeless. Well, you keep, we keep perfecting this horrible racist joke. <laughs> yeah. Did you hear Fuller House? Uh-huh. Yeah. To go with the field of, you know, like there's a house. Oh, it, well, it doesn't have to go <laughs> with it. It doesn't have to go with it. <laughs> it could be a completely separate joke. But it do does. Well. It just <laughs> yeah. does. You're just connecting it. I'm not trying to. I just have a genius brain. <laughs> I just like that we have the, the drive and there's something with like, some frequency we're on that just uh, just we yeah. find it. Well, I'm trying to move out that You're topic. Always I'm, trying looking to, for I'm trying to say a shoeless Joe kill Gallon or oh, okay. shoeless, shoeless Joe kill Court or Fernandez or save Court. Julius Joe save Court. Joe Big. <laughs> or shoeless Joe Bananas. <laughs> shoeless Joe Bananas. I like that. I, I sent Joe my. Uh, just sell some I, of those bananas and buy some shoes. I, I sent Joe. Joe, Joe my clip of me uh, doing the Jack Nicholson monologue and at some if he said, <laughs> sent it to some agents for me. You know what, Fernandez? And he said, I don't think this is what they're looking for. I was like, dude, I, I, was like, dude, I really want to play Jack Nicholson in The Departed. It already came out. <laughs> I want to play Jack Nicholson in The Departed. That's my, that my favorite part of the That's video. That's like my idea for Frasier 2, where the actors are playing themselves acting. <laughs> yeah, and, yeah. Like, hey, but you're I'm playing like, Jack Nicholson. I really, want to play playing, ja- yeah, I really want to play Jack Nicholson in The Departed <laughs> from 2004. I want to play Jimmy Fallon in <laughs> the impression of Chris Rock. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, what about Chris Stonehenge? That was pretty ooh. good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Well, everybody hates Chris. <laughs> Chris but it's, everybody it, yeah. hates Dylan, but it's because I'm doing a what about everybody impression hates, of Jimmy Everybody Fallon. hates Chris Geico. How about that? Will Smith hates Chris. Except for us. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, lo- we love the whole roast battle team, except for Matt Bamwert. Yeah, the, the ghost <laughs> battle team, once I get my hands around their neck. I like Chris Geico, and I, I like Kev Kellum. Except, I, I Kev, I got to say, I don't like when you uh, gave Dylan Cauliflower ear. Yeah, that was fucked yeah, up, was Kevin. Fucked up, from Kevin. Cold, from Snow Cold Stuttering him. They sh- you should change your name sounds... to Kevin cauliflower um. Kevin <laughs> Kevin sounds... The first time I heard him, Kevin Kellum sounded kind of like Jim Gaffigan to me, his voice. Yeah. I thought he could be like Jim D- Gaffigan's little brother. Dim Gaffigan. Dim Gaffigan, yeah. <laughs> and they would watch uh, WWE growing up together and kind of bond over it. But then uh, Jim Gaffigan kind of grew out of it, started doing comedy. And uh, Kevin followed in his footsteps. How about this? How about and he's dim, kind of, uh, dim, uh, <laughs> and killed it, Mac. Dim laugh, not a lot. I was well, the thing again, that you told me. I was to gonna, say. I was gonna do one like that. Is uh, Kevin Kelm's <laughs> version of Jim Gaffigan would be Jim so traumatized from watching this, I'll never laugh again. Mm-hmm. That's yeah. good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, di- <laughs> dim, dim, not comedy. laugh again. Yeah, just kind of chasing the dragon of uh, losing his brother, getting his brother back. His brother died. <laughs> no, it's just he kind of outgrew him. Oh yeah, his brother is cooler than him. He just kind of he yeah, didn't we find should the have Kevin. We should have cool Kevin Cullen's anymore. brother on the podcast. Yeah, Jim he, Gaffigan. Jim Gaffigan. Yeah, well, he, have you ever seen Kevin no. Cullen talk about his brother? No. He talks about how his brother's way cooler and better than. Him. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> he has like a fucking twenty minutes. On <laughs> that would be so <laughs> funny if, if, we, if we found him. <laughs> and, and, <laughs> and, <laughs> and the whole time we're just like, dude, you're cool as fuck. We keep, we keep like high fiving him. <laughs> he's like a surgeon or something. I mean, part of the joke is like he's successful at his parents' level board. Yeah, but that'd be funny if he was like. 
wore like a leather, like, oh, yeah. like a leather jacket, and it was like cool as fuck. Oh, he's just like the fun. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the, the whole time we're like, hell yeah, dude. he's got a switchblade comb. <laughs> <laughs> I got a real switchblade, folks. <laughs> yes, sir. Hot pockets. Right. <sighs> hell yeah. <laughs> oh, met, met, I showed Meta this. He loved this. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, shut up, Meta. What's up, Meta? <laughs> We could uh, that actually would get you in the country if if you're Mexican. Yeah, <laughs> if you have one of those. In the border. <laughs> <laughs> it should be how it works. You're like his NFT cards. Did you see his commercial? Is that an NFT? Those? Oh no, no. something else. He just had like these. Were I thought it was a joke at first. Like I thought, no way, this is real. But it's so good when he sold like a bunch of hundred dollar NFTs. Like <laughs> that's hilarious, Donald Trump. Dude, commemorative coins were kind of the original NFTs. Uh-huh. Now that I think about it, like Absolutely. that shit they sell on. Uh, like late night on TV. These ones are special. A oh, field of beans. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I also realized <laughs> it's, it's that just a, uh, a bunch of clones of beans from even Steven. How about Field of Dreams? They're all <laughs> they're playing, they're playing baseball and they're ghosts. I also realized recently that the Bernie <laughs> Mac show was the original Office because he talks to the camera in, the, uh-huh. in between. <laughs> Talk to the camera because the, fa- the you face know like they do the, yeah, the, the style. Yeah, mm-hmm. the I Bernie say, Mac show was first. Wow. I say talk to the camera because the face don't want to hear it. I'm surprised they don't. They didn't. Re- <laughs> but everybody out there, the millions of fans would love to. Yeah. We, need a, we need a. <laughs> we need a Bernie Mac show reunion. Bernie Mac Nepper. <coughs> I didn't sleep last night. I just watched movies all night. Yeah, and, I, uh, I, I barely slept. <laughs> I, I finished a movie and then I, it was like the sun was rising. I was like, what? I no. watched this movie called Rampage, and it's not the Rock one. There's another movie called Rampage on Amazon Prime. I've seen it. I believe. It, What's it about? It's a kind of movie you would watch. What's it about? It's literally ten minutes of a guy like fantasizing about just becoming an active shooter. Oh, and he had, and then it's like he, an hour he, he of him it. shooting up yeah, the town, yeah, yeah. and then he gets away with uh-huh. it. Wow! And it's like, that who is this for? Nice. Yeah, this is like a fantasy of people who want to do this. Well, Dylan's gonna say he hasn't it's seen it, but we all know. <laughs> we, all, we all know Dylan's seen that one. You no, look no, like no. the guy from it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you do. And this, because there's a part two. What? Yeah, there's a part two. It's called. Does he do it again? It's called Rampage Capital Punishment. Yes, he does. does he, at the Capitol? But he no, he takes <laughs> over a news station, and then he for he's been. I think he's been watching Joe. Rogan. Okay, don't tell me too much. Though. He's been watching Joe Rogan for two years, and then he takes over a news station and has all these. Awful okay, well, poli- that, he has all these awful political talking points throughout the whole thing. Wow. This, this, it's, there's this, no this spoilers. Is it's the same movie again with Joe Rogan talking points. <laughs> what channel is it on? It's on Prime, also. Really? <laughs> yeah, Fuck the stream. Yeah. Dude, yeah, no, check I out said, Rampage, I, Capital Punishment. I watch yeah. them both, one after the other. If you guys want to watch it. The second yeah. one is so low budget, they use a lot of footage from the first one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, that most of the movie is just him just shooting up a town. <laughs> it's wild. Wow. It's the like first John one, Wick, but no dogs. Yeah, it's like just John, skip the dude, dogs. <laughs> dude, yeah, it is like John Wick a lot. <laughs> That's such a hilarious comparison. <laughs> It's basically John Wick. Except instead of bad guys. Actually, yeah. Honest, honestly. <laughs> he just walks around shooting people. <laughs> but nobody shot his it's, dog. It's, pre- it's pretty fucked up that just to save a dog, he, he killed probably 100 humans at least. It's true. It's true. <laughs> wow. Yeah. And I, I Some think people I, say, I hate people. I love dogs. Yeah. I hate, I'll take the dogs. Yeah, but 100 people to one dog. Uh-huh. You, you got to save the people, folks. People hate people. I yeah. watched the newest well, one, and uh, well, there's a part where he tells uh, Lawrence Fishburne or somebody on, uh, what. <laughs> well, I, I said people hate people, and I whispered what color, just because it's part of one of my Why? new jokes. It's <laughs> never mind. But then you said Lawrence Fishburne. Well, yeah. I was, I, I was thinking John Blick. Mix him up with that other black guy. That have you ever heard about the stories of people mixing them up? Who's but, the other guy? Uh, it's probably also him. That's a confusing <laughs> part. They're not. Ma- <laughs> oh, is it uh, the guy with the lazy eye? Who do they mix Lawrence Forrest, Fishburne? Forrest, Forrest uh, like, Whitaker. Forrest Whitaker. No. Oh, it maybe, might be Samuel L. Jackson. Maybe or something. Uh, I would never mix him up with no, anybody. He's maybe there's someone that looks maybe like, Lawrence Mammelburn. People oh, in like Lawrence or, Mammelburn or Birdburn. <laughs> Martin Lawrence Fishburne. <laughs> yep. Mark. <laughs> yes, I know him. It will be real interviewers like asking him about movies he's not in. He's like, I'm not that guy. That's fucked and up. And then they're like, oh, I want to know. I'll but send it to you. Send it to me. Is it just you like Lawrence Fishbourne even more? <laughs> is it probably just a uh, like a middle aged black guy? Is it Denzel? 
No, it's probably but somebody a movie what, that it's probably somebody one tier below. It, Denzel. Is it, I think that's the funniest. Thing. Is it Keanu Reeves? Because like I feel, like, <laughs> I feel like Lawrence Fishburne is a B list <laughs> actor, like while Denzel is an A list. No way, Lawrence Fishburne's A list. Nice no, B. Dude, you he's in so many great you, movies. You look it up, Jason. He's look in every. Lawrence yeah, but he's, he's normally not the main character. Wait, who is the other guy? Yeah, you like? Not, uh, Denzel is, is just. <laughs> yeah, Denzel's bigger. Denzel's bigger. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, they're both A. The I, no, but the reason Denzel's A plus. The reason I think Fishburne's B is because he's normally a supporting actor. I see what you're saying, but uh, I I don't know, man. He's so good. The Fishburne no, supremacy. You can be a really good B list actor. <laughs> is that what it is when you're just? I mean, he's like the A of B. I yeah, mean, yeah. he's like in every great movie. Yeah, well, he's 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 like the top. Yeah, but he's like. Why is ma- he never the main guy? I don't know. Samuel Jackson never too. Kind of Pulp Fiction. He's like one of the main guys, but there's no main no, guy. No, Samuel Jackson is main guy in and, some movies. And, uh, Black Snake Moan. Well, in, in Pulp <laughs> in, 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 in Pulp Fiction, he's the co-main guy. Sort of. There's there's no real main guy because Bruce Willis. I mean, he's not even in the Bruce Willis part. Uh, yeah, that's true. That, that movie sucks. I saw Quentin Tarantino. <laughs> I actually like it. <laughs> no. no. You saw him? No. It's Quentin Taran terrible. Mm-hmm. What, I hate that movie. Yeah. Back? No, he's uh, told me to not I'm, like the movie. Okay. Because do you think we're teaming up on you? <laughs> do it. This, you guys just have no, this did, natural. You kind of look like Bruce Willis from that movie. Yeah. You did. Yeah. Yes, you're Bruce Willis. You have the same style. Bruce Willis. You have the same style of acting. <laughs> you and him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I have like Bruce, Bruce Willis's Willis brain now. now. Remember when Rendell got? You hear about Bruce Willis's yeah, brain? It's really like sad. melting. That's really why I said yeah. that. I got that. Remember when Rendell got hit by a semi truck and he was just fine. Who's right Rendell? On, right on Rendell. My friend from <laughs> high school. I don't remember that. Was Dude, how you been joke? doing? He's been, I've been all right. Got hit by a semi truck. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> like, okay. He had no visible like, anything bad on him. And he's, he's, he's just Bruce Willis from Unbreakable. <laughs> My dad looks like Bruce Willis. And he got hit by a semi once when he was in his truck. No, we were telling Rendell we were going to oh, shoot shit. him to test it out. It's like, I feel like I got hit by a bus. Or it was a bus. Yeah. Anyway. A blunderbuss. Blunderbuss. Blunderbusses are cool guns. That's the one like the the fan. It looks like a fa- like a, or like a like a, it looks like a trumpet kind of. That sounds trumpet. so cool. It's like, like the the pilgrims guns. Those Ooh, are the pilgrims. I had. love the pilgrims. I mean the pills. I don't mm-hmm. know about pilgrims. I like, I like, I like, a, I like a, one gram, of, gram, one gram of pills. I, I, like the, I like the pills and I like the grams. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Don't, give me a, don't give me a pilgrim, but I'll take a gram of pills. I feel like, <laughs> like, that much. Pilgrams. I feel like you could do some good wordplay with pilgrim and sell it to Gucci Mane yeah. for a song. Uh-huh. I'll, take a gra- I'll take a gram of pills. Uh-huh. I'm, not ta- I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not talking milligrams, folks. I don't know. A whole gram. <laughs> I'm not talking milligrams. I'm not talking pilgrims. I'm talking mm-hmm. gram of pills. Pilgrams. <laughs> Can I use that? Yeah, it's all yours. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> you can have it. But, wow. then, but then I'm going to call you out publicly. Yeah, and later we'll it. call you a stealer. <laughs> <Are they? laughs> <laughs> Which it'll have no effect because we call everyone that. You can. Mm-hmm. One one joke that's really good that I will give you is you can use the one about um, about when I went to Chester Bennigan's and then there was the, the, the waiter said, hey, I'm your waiter. So I thought they said wait here. So uh-huh. I waited there. <laughs> okay, I can use that. And then, and then I apologize to him because I misheard him. Close with that. Yeah, so I'll, you can have that one. Thank you. Uh-huh. <laughs> make sure, yeah, make sure it's your closer or your opener because that uh-huh. one really hits. I'll probably open with <laughs> that the, joke. Rips. Maybe, maybe the end with the paper cut thing. Oh yeah, <laughs> he, he's such a pussy. He died by the yeah. self-inflicted paper cut. Uh-huh. <laughs> Do you know that? That's such a surbending. He used a paper cut. What? He used a paper cut. Oh my god! <laughs> he used a paper cut. Did he paper cut? Like, he paper cut his neck. <laughs> not perpendicular. No, he but, grew up paper cutting himself. On his wrist. Yeah. He paper cut him. Vertically. He cut. A, he paper cut his own head off. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You would think that he was because it's because he was so numb. Like yeah. he, he would just use. Like oh a, yeah, you're right. Yeah. He couldn't feel it. He wouldn't be able to feel it. So why wouldn't he just what use? A a, why wouldn't he just use a knife instead no. of paper cut? Orange yeah. Floyd was comfortably numb. He, he's That's such a very different oh, guy. Yeah. Or, orange he Floyd. Was, uh, he was pa- uncomfortably numb. Uh, well, yeah, I guess he was begging for his life. Uh, orange, orange, orange <laughs> Floyd is, is a band. I never watched the video. You know that song. Go ahead and pull it by, up. Breathe by Orange Floyd. Breathe by Orange Floyd. Yeah. Breathe, uh, 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 breathe in no, his no, knees. No, that's, that's, my, <laughs> that's my fabulous. <laughs> He's, Fashion, don't breathe. Uh, I gotta tell you guys a really funny joke after the podcast. Breathe by 
bum, Somebody bum, else's joke. Bum, bum. Nice. Show these N words can't breathe when I come through. I got to be 20, man. It's not even funny. They can't breathe. We should make a rap song soon. We should make a rap song soon. Mm-hmm. Just like a Nothing regular rap song. Brown. Yeah. I've been trying to make some beats. Uh, not. Not very consistently. I suck at it. I hate the way my shit sounds. It doesn't sound cool at all to me, but mm-hmm. it's like a beat, but it doesn't sound good. <sighs> I don't know how to do it. I've been watching these videos on YouTube. The shit uh, sucks. Uh, mm-hmm. Do you know who this beats? I say, Yesterday at Power Hour, this person, uh, my, to, to, Michael Cooper, Nero came and Nero was like outside hanging Nero out. Divergent? Hanging out with just some of the most altered, mentally ill comedians ever. Let me guess. Or just like Michael nobody Cooper, else will Bob talk Traeger, to them. Yeah. No, no, female. All female, but all, uh, non-binary. But No. Uh, so Nura's out there talking to somebody named Bo. I don't know who this person is. I never met them. They just sent me an apology on Instagram. Really? But basically... That's nice. They're talking to Nura, and uh, Nura hates poly people for some reason. <laughs> Like whenever she's in a bad mood, she goes on Facebook and starts fights with people. <laughs> it's so funny to me, dude. Well, they 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 canceled the Mormons for being polygamous, and then yeah. it immediately became polyamorous. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. They're, they're, like, they're like, we don't want you to do that, so we can do it. <laughs> yeah, polyamorous. <laughs> yeah, dude. Fuck fuck liberals. All you liberal, any li- liberal listening right now, mm-hmm. suck my dick. Dude, I, this I'm story- not a Republican either. I'm Bubba Sparksist. I don't have a. I'm not right wing. I'm not left wing. I have a dorsal. Dude, I have a dorsal fin. This in the story. Middle. This story and involves suck that. each other's dick. I have a, do- so, I have a dorsal so this, fin. This though. bow person who's <laughs> never had one conversation with me ever. And has just met my girlfriend Nura. Nur, like, start, they start talking about how they're poly, and then Nura's like shitting on it, and and then uh, <laughs> they're like, "Give it a chance sometime." And Nura's like, "No." <laughs> yeah. It was weird. Say, Nura loves gender roles too. Yeah, Nura. Lo- she hates. Uh, she's just a classic woman. She she's a classic. Bullshit. She's a lady. She's uh-huh. yeah. Dude looks like a lady. <laughs> that's when you that's when you accidentally like, uh, mistake St- uh, Stevie Wonder for Nura. I feel like, <laughs> when you see uh, Stevie Wonder walking down the street. Oh yeah, yeah. And and you actually th- accidentally think it's Nura. Dude, have you ever seen Stevie Wonder's and eyes? You're, and you're like, so scary. And you're like, Nura Nura. seems to get like. And you're like Nura, like no, I'm Stevie Wonder. <laughs> or she gets in a fight with somebody each time, like a, the Jewish guy, or like this. Oh yeah, she's always having beef with people. Oh yeah. She's a little shit stir. She's, like, she's like Osama bin Laden. She's always stirring the shit. Uh-huh. Or, uh huh. Yeah, she's she's like me. Uh-huh. So yeah. in that aspect, I, th- I think we have a now we kind of have mutual respect of that. Cause oh I'm yeah, not, she's complimented that you you were being really nice at Beer Belly the other night when yeah. she was there. <laughs> no, I, 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 I brought back the thing about um, how we should. We were talking about animals, and I was talking about. Oh yeah, uh, I was like, yeah. but I think we should. I still think we should put all in a barrel and explode <laughs> uh-huh. them. She, <laughs> she's and then she like, was like, uh, Mac. I was like, I'm kidding. Her, uh, <laughs> she's so oh, sensitive, Mac. dude. <laughs> about yeah. certain, it's about certain things. Yeah, I know. Anyway, this bow person's talking to Nura and just starts trash. Like, doesn't even know who I am at first. Nura's like, I'm dating Jason, and uh, there's other people there. So they explain to dating a Jason. They explain to this bow person that who I am, and then this person just shits on me like. You could do so much better than him. He's like, what the fuck? he's crusty and Republican. Do you, do you know who it is? Yeah. Okay. The, the I'm saying is? their name eight times. Bo something. No, the other person. The other people there? The other one that was shit. Uh, Bo, uh, Bo was shitting on you? The Bo person was. <laughs> they called me a Republican. <laughs> Just because I voted for Donald Trump does not make me a Republican. Uh, and, and, and I like him and you voted for I'm a, like the Joker. And you voted for Osama Bin Laden. And I voted for Osama Bin Laden. No, look. Well, that, that's, I actually did vote for Donald Trump to be the Joker. <laughs> It was, it was a bit. <laughs> if, if <laughs> who's worse, by the bit. way, who's worse, Republicans or people who have never met you and try and ruin your relationship? <laughs> oh, yeah. Who's worse? <laughs> I'm not. I don't vote, dude. No, I never like, vote. I will never vote my life, guys. Just so you know, my, my political affiliations is I, I voted for Donald Trump as a bit the first time, and the second time I wrote in Willie Nelson. I, I waited to vote and <laughs> to write in. A, you did as a bit the first time, and the second time you were serious. And the second time I, I wrote in Willie Nelson, <laughs> and then and then. I voted for every other position based on whose name was cooler. So if yeah. there's alliteration, I love alliteration. I would vote for them. Yeah, you know, Jason's I just traced, I just traced my dick on the ballot. Yeah, you know, the ballot's about six inches, so it, 
fit perfectly. Five and a half. <laughs> yeah, five and a half. <laughs> well, if your dick wasn't that hard, then you'd probably have to be. Oh yeah, because you're, you're a grower, right? Soft, so it's yeah. probably two inches. Yeah, you're right. I have to get soft. <laughs> Jason's a one <laughs> issue voter. Yeah. Yeah. What's the issue? It, what they they got to be white. the outline of my dick is my oh, only no, issue. Is it, no, uh, it got to be white or something? Yeah. It was like. A, oh yeah, they white. have to be white. That's what it is. I'm a single voter. The president has to be white. Yeah. That's a really old reference. <laughs> yeah, he has to be. It has white. to be white. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. Republican. So fuck you, Bo. I know you sent me an apology, but still fuck you. Still I mean, leave me the fuck up. alone. Don't try and fuck up my life when you don't know anything about me. Hey, Are you trying to break up a family when you don't yeah. have one? Loser. I just hey, met yeah. this person. I don't know anything about them. I'm going to see if I could get them to lose their job. And Let's their try to get them to destroy their life. Yeah, I don't, I don't, if I could get I don't, them to I don't, I don't want to shit on this Bo them. person, but I'm pretty sure she was... Uh, in in the fight with me and Max Sorich, she, or she was in the circle, not really saying anything. Uh-huh. Let me know. It uh, might be they. I don't. I thought it was a they for some. Let reason. me know. Who, let me know who is more correct, Bo, me or Max Sorich. Thank mm. you. Yeah. <laughs> also, fuck, uh, he's doing fuck, the work fuck of Max Sorich. <laughs> Nura said, Bo is uh, doing the work of Satan. <laughs> <laughs> Let's send him to hell. Nura goes. Bo is defending Lizzo. That was a big red flag. That's what Nura said. <laughs> Nura hates Lizzo. And then she is. Lizzo's and here's the thing. I thought me and Bo were cool because during their set in a Power Hour, they're like talking about how they live by O'Hare and they like the airplanes going over like Free Willy. And I said, "How'd you know Lizzo was on the plane?" (laughs) (laughs) And they laughed. Or how'd you know it wasn't Ham Talent? Yeah, the same joke. Yeah, could have been Ham (laughs) because he's a pig with wings. The pig. I mean, he doesn't take planes because pigs can fly. He's Ham Talents. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) I saw Chris Damon at uh, No (laughs) Hair. No air airport. Airport. Yeah, I like yeah. that. You just go with that. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. <laughs> well, there is. There. Well, that that joke itself. There, uh, they call it. There's a billboard for Brian Lecker where they say, "Oh, hair airport." No. Like, what, hair. Oh, well, okay, that's similar. It's the same thing. Tired of going to no hair. I think it might have been. Why don't you go that. to no hair, Ro- hair Rogaine mm-hmm. or lacquer? I think we did a hair lacquer on the podcast. I think that was oh, awesome. that was a long time ago. We did a bunch. Yeah. Was on the I think that was awesome. That was that was maybe the second the hair <laughs> the second uh-huh. when you came. Out. Yeah. yeah. Oh, <laughs> history. That's there. why you got to subscribe to our Patreon so you can get all the old episodes. Well, in about uh, four minutes, folks, we're gonna uh, switch over to uh, just thirty minutes of really fucked up shit. If you thought the first hour, we was do thirty fucked minutes up. for the Patreon. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I got. I've been making little things. notes of all the really bad stuff I want to say. Hell yeah! Mm-hmm. <laughs> I just wrote down uh, a swastika. Mm, that was a Mark Drew. Norman joke. An illustration. What? He had his notebook on stage, and he goes, oh, "Don't worry about this. It's all swastikas." Mm-hmm. Okay, well, that's that's a joke that's like been done. I think I've. Er, <laughs> he just said that about his own joke. I, 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 I think I did that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're doing it now. <laughs> I, no, I think I did that joke at like North Bar really early on. I feel like all those because I never brought a notebook on stage, and I was like, I just finally just had to start using a notebook, and I was yeah. reading the notes, and then it was a swastika. This just the, a writer does great. a writer does it with a dick. Yeah. When I was new, I used to say that my notes on stage were because I always brought a note on stage even at shows, and I was to try and smooth it over. I said it was a list of my friends who were ticklish. Wow. What I say is that I, probably not work. Oh, it worked great. What I was saying, wow. crushed. What I, was, <laughs> what I would say on so stage, absurd. if I look at my phone, you don't know anything about comedy. Tell me, it don't work. No, it worked. But in my notebook, once I actually had written down like making fun of Jews is okay, and then three dollar <laughs> signs, and I remember like telling the audience, <laughs> and then they saw like you wrote it real big it so they could see it from the stage. No. <laughs> they, they, saw just, your, they saw the rest of it around. Yeah. It, so it was like, Guys, folks, Dylan's notebook looks like current Bam Margera. Uh, just, <laughs> just, just, just Bam Margera, yeah. just Bam Margera's it's, it's, life it's at the moment. It's essentially his diary in yeah. general. <laughs> yeah, and falling out with all the boys. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I heard uh, Ryan Dunn had a falling out of his front windshield. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that did happen. <laughs> what was that joke I had that Shane helped me do? Or it's um, oh, it's I'm 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 non I'm non v. Wait, no, no, no. I'll Who's Shane? I'll, Shane Bian. Oh, uh, uh, b- 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 banana. Um, they should call that guy Brain Bianchi. They should call because he, he gives so many no, funny jokes. He gives, uh, John oh, because he gives he, brain. He gives John Hickok brain. Yeah, he can give John That's Hickok brain, brain standing up. Oh, you know they're John, both standing up and he's just <laughs> sucking his dick. You know that John Hick- <laughs> John Hickok told me he thought you weren't funny when he saw you at Mike's, but then oh. he saw you do a real show and he's like, oh, he's funny. Oh yeah, yeah. Because yeah. at Mike's they try new stuff. Well, me, I, I, I. I Try to do bad in mics. Uh, yeah. 
Mm-hmm. It's kind of a safe route. I've never, I, I, I still have never bombed on a real show, mm-hmm. except, except for the one that doesn't count from Detroit because there was only comics there. <laughs> and there's four. There's four comics. Oh, uh-huh. okay. And the 9/11 joke still did well. It's not a real shit. Oh, I got. I, I, I never seen. Wait, I never seen Dale McPeep on, but one time I saw somebody in the kitchen throw firecrackers at him. <laughs> my open mic a long time ago. <laughs> they, they, was he unaffected? He stopped coming to my open mic after that. He's like the same size. <laughs> Dale's like the same size as like a nuclear bomb, kind of. Mm. Or do, mm. you, you know how they dropped that mother of all bombs on that like uh, Taliban mountain or something? Mm. Oh, the mother Dale's, of all Dale's, I remember them saying that. Dale's the mother of all bombs. <laughs> Dude, that was pretty. That was Dale's mom. <laughs> that was pretty audacious for them to call that the mother of all bombs. When we literally dropped atom bombs on Hiroshima and yeah. shit, like there's no way. It was well, that it's, good. it's crazy they call it the mother of all bombs because every time I see Adam Crochetti go on stage, that's <laughs> <laughs> not accurate. <laughs> yeah, it is. He yeah. fucks it up, folks. Stage. Run the secrets tier for the uh, for the DMs. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are we doing that? Hell yeah! I don't know. I think it drops tomorrow. Maybe. I, oh, I, 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 didn't, I, just, I didn't see that one. I because uh, you guys aren't in the secrets tier. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm sorry. And, dude, and there's, there's no way for me to like let you in for free. If if I if if I add like I give you half the secrets, I don't want to pay for it. <laughs> yeah, no. no, just send them to us. Yeah. <laughs> well, the thing is, I, I mean, I, I send them to you anyway. But we uh, send them to you unless they're about you. Then we keep no. But them I could <laughs> I could add it. I could I could make it like so. It's like a team thing where the whole team can edit the Patreon and they take like like five percent more off the top. No, nah, don't do that. that. So it's not worth yeah. it. No. So. It's all about the money, folks. That's why we started comedy. Yeah. Um, if you can't sell your comedy, then you suck. And that's an hour. <laughs> now say that, hey, uh, if you guys uh, join patreon.com slash bad comedy to get the actual content. Yes, yeah. the real stuff. That was our warm up. Now we're actually they're starting a British bad comedy. It's called lad comedy. Really? No. All right. I mean, yes. Sorry. Yes. Okay. <laughs> See you guys. I forgot to guess Ant. Wow. All right. Bye. You want to say bye to the free bye, people? Bye, everybody. Check bye. out my album recording. Yep. Bye-bye.